All right. Fine. My name's Jeffrey. So what? Jay told you my name. Big fucking deal. And according to the stutterer Randy, Aunt Barbara's dead. And I suppose you incompetent fools think I had something to do with that. Look, just because I'm a loudmouth and I cuss all the time doesn't mean to say that I know anything about a fucking death. I told you, when we arrived at Aunt Barbara's house yesterday, I was plunged into blackness and I didn't see anything. I didn't even know she was fucking dead until that idiot Randy started fucking stammering about it. Who are you calling an idiot, Jeffrey? You're not a nice person. Fuck off, Randy, instead of my fucking conversation. No, Jay, no. Let me deal with this. Jay, I'm, I'm trying to protect you. Just let me help you. There's someone in your head. The... Uh, it's me, Jay. I, I, I promise I have complete control. I'll try and keep Randy and Jeffrey separated and locked in their rooms. So this is what we know. My sweet Aunt Barbara is dead. Randy knows something, but Jeffrey claims to know nothing. He's been with me a long time. And yes, he can be a jerk sometimes, but he isn't capable of murder. Look, detectives, I'm trying to turn my life around. I met a woman recently. She's a waitress at the cafe near where my flat is. I wasn't just going to borrow money from my aunt. I was going to tell her about my new girlfriend and explain to her that I'm going to get my disorder under control so that I can build a relationship with Sally. What?